If you're running a WordPress website, you need to be thinking about backups. And today we're diving into one of the most popular backup plugins out there, Updraft Plus. In this video, we're going to break down what Updraft Plus is, show you its key features, compare the free and premium versions, and share our honest thoughts after testing it out. All right, so what exactly is Updraft Plus? Updraft Plus is a WordPress plugin that lets you easily backup, restore, and even migrate your website all with just a few clicks. It's currently one of the most downloaded backup plugins in the WordPress repository with over 3 million active installations and thousands of five-star reviews. Whether you're running a blog, an online store, or a business site, backups are essential. Website can break, get hacked, or crash after a bad update, and having a tool like Updraft Plus can literally save your site. It supports scheduled backups, manual backups, and even lets you store your backup files on remote storage platforms like Google Drive, Dropbox, OneDrive, and more. If you're serious about keeping your website safe, Updraft Plus is one of the top tools to consider. Now let's talk about some of the features of Updraft Plus. Now one of the most attractive features of Updraft Plus is the backup and restore. Updraft Plus lets you backup and restore your WordPress website with just one click. We can take a look at their website. It says backup WordPress files and the database. Backup everything in the WordPress content directory and every database table beginning with the WP underscore prefix. So let's head over to our WordPress websites and see this feature. This is our test WordPress website and we have Updraft Plus installed. Now in the backup and restore tab here you can see that you have the option to backup your site just by clicking on this button. We can also add changed files which is the incremental backup. So only the changed files will be backed up and the rest of the files will remain the same. Although this feature is only available in the premium version of this plugin. We can also see the current time and we can also see our existing backups over here. To restore a backup, we can simply click on the restore button and we can restore our backups. You can see that it's so easy with the one click backup and restore. Another feature is the scheduled backup. Now this is also very important because sometimes you might not have the time to back up your site every time you work on your site. In that case, what you can do is schedule a backup with Updraft Plus so you can run it every 2, 4, 8 or 12 hours, daily, weekly, fortnightly or monthly. Updraft Plus can take care of that. So we're here back in our website and if we click on the settings, here we can see the backup file schedule and database backup schedule. From here you can choose every 2 hours, 4 hours, 8 hours, every 12 hours, daily, weekly, monthly, and you can also assign the number of backups you want to keep or retain from here as well. If we scroll down and see over here, include in the files backup, we can include what we want. This is a neat feature as you might not have the time to backup your site every time, so we can schedule our backups and Updraft Plus will keep the backups for us. Now we can see that there are some premium features such as automatically backup before updates, backup incrementally, backup individual tables. Now these backup features are only available in the premium version and we will take a look at it when we are talking about the free versus premium section. Now let's talk about the next feature which is the storage. Now Updraft Plus allows you to backup your files on remote storage such as Google Drive, Dropbox, Amazon S3, Rackspace, Cloud Files, FTP, Dream Objects, OpenStack, Swift or email. If we head over to our WordPress website and click on the settings tab, here we can choose the remote storage where we want to store our backup. We can store it to Updraft Vault, we can store it to an FTP, S3 compatible generic, we can store it to Dropbox, Microsoft Azure, pCloud, Amazon S3, SFTP, SCP, OpenStack, and you can see there are so many options, including Google Drive and OneDrive. Now, there are more premium features such as backup to premium locations, Google Drive, Dropbox enhancements. So if you want to backup to subfolders rather than default app folder, you can do that as well with the premium version. Now, the next feature that we want to talk about is the migrate feature. With Updraft Plus, you can also migrate in minutes. You can download backups from a source site and then you can restore them on a destination site. And it also has the search and replace built in, which reduces the risk of associated with manual migrations. It identifies the old strings and replaces them with the new ones. And it also has migration cleanup feature. Let's head over to our WordPress website and let's click on the migrate and clone tab. Now here we can create a temporary clone on our server 
we can just click on this create a temporary clone on our server button and we can add in our email password then we can click on connect or we can use an updraft clone key from here and then we can connect we can also migrate clone or duplicate our site using updraft plus now i want to show you guys how you can back up your site with just one click so we're back here in our test site and we want to take a backup so the last backup we took was back in august 18th in 2024 so it's been a long time since we have backed up anything so let's go ahead and take a backup. We're going to click on this backup now button and then we can choose what to include. We want to include the database, we want to include the files and then we are going to click on this backup now button and we're just going to wait for a few seconds until this is done. Now how long we have to wait it depends on the size of your site. If you have a big site it's going to take a long time but if you have a smaller website it's not going to take that long. And that's it, our backup is complete. And now we can see that this is our last backup. Now if we want, we can delete the other backup or we can simply restore this backup by clicking on this restore button. Now if we want, we can also delete a backup just by clicking over here and clicking on delete. That's how easy it is to back up your site using Updraft Plus. Now let's talk about the free versus premium feature. So if we head over to the premium extensions tab here we can take a look at some of the differences between updraft free and updraft premium so with the free version you get the backup to remote storage locations but cloning and migration is only available in the premium version you also get another feature called anonymization and it anonymizes your personal data in your database backups which you do not get with the free version another feature that you get in the premium version is the incremental backups which allows you to only backup changes to your files instead of backing up everything so this actually saves you some server resources and it also has fast and personal support so whenever you need a support you can rely on a draft plus support team and there are also many features you can see if we start talking about all of these it will take so long time but you get features such as pre-update backups, backup non-WordPress files and databases, network and multi-sites, backup time and schedule, WPCLI support, more database options. So you get all of these with the premium version. And with the premium version, you also get the updraft vault storage of one gigabyte if you upgrade to the premium plan. Now let's also head over to the website and take a look at the price of Updraft Plus Premium. And here we can see there are so many pricing options. From here you can choose your currency. Currently the US dollar is selected. You can also choose your country from here. But let's take a look at these plans that we can see right now. The personal plan is $70 per year. It gives you premium support, one gigabyte internal storage and one Updraft clone token. You can use it uh, on up to two sites. We can take a look at the business plan which you can use on up to 10 sites. It's available for $95 a year and you get everything that you got on the personal except you get one more updraft clone tokens. The agency plan is available for $145 a year and you can use it on up to 35 sites and this gives you five updraft clone tokens instead of two. The next plan is the enterprise plan and you can use it on unlimited sites and it's available for $195 a year and with it you get 10 updraft clone tokens. And finally the gold plan, it also gives you unlimited site usage and it's available for $399 a year and it gives you 50 gigabyte internal storage, 10 updraft clone tokens, plus you can manage centrally with updraft central. So with that, you can understand how powerful updraft plus is. So it also brings us to the end of this video. We hope that it was helpful for you guys. And if you guys want to learn how you can back up your website using updraft plus, we have a tutorial on that topic. You can find it in our video description. So that's it for today's video. We hope that it was helpful for you guys. If you found this video helpful, give it a like and subscribe to our channel for more helpful videos on WordPress. So thank you for watching. See you next time.